Hello, my name is Kate Brennan and I am in York, Pennsylvania. I am thrilled that my piece, What's in Store, a Swedish dramedy, is going to be part of the B Street Theatre Comedy Festival 2023. Disillusioned with her recent futile apartment search and the equally futile state of the world, JC finds solace in the clean lines and the prefab layouts of her local Swedish furniture store. Dope take. So, she moves in. I am so excited to work with B Street because one, this will be the first time that real life professional actors have joined in space in time to work on this piece. And there is nothing like having people share space and time to collaborate and manifest the potential of a theater piece. Two, I can't wait to see what the other comedy writers are working on and how they are bringing light to these very dark trying times. And three, just, I just think the world needs more comedy. Don't you? Hi, my name is Alyssa Haddad Chen. I'm reporting to you live from Brooklyn, New York. I'm originally from upstate New York, and I am the playwright of The Newlywed Game. The Newlywed Game is a play that follows a young couple that is starting to form their life together. They're not yet married, but they're living together and figuring things out. Uh, they've done a really, really hard and big step in that direction by inviting their very traditional families over who are from very different backgrounds to host Thanksgiving and everybody comes armed with food and secrets. I'm so excited to bring the Newlywed Game to the New Comedies Festival at B Street Theater. I'm, I think I'm most excited because it'll get to be in front of an audience and I think an audience is super important in new play development. So. I hope that you'll come see it and tell me what you think. Thank you so much, and I hope to see you there. Bye. Kestrels. Oh, hi. I'm Ashley Quatch from Los Angeles, California. I wrote the romantic medieval farce, Pseudo Princess Thief. The premise is pretty simple. What if you were a princess cursed to live on a barren rock in the woods, waiting for true love's kiss to set you free? What if the wrong kiss meant death? Not your death, but instant agonizing for your suitor. Well, how much of your day do you think you would end up spending doing corpse detail? Well, that's where we start. But the play really begins when a thief breaks into the princess's cottage while she is out burying Sir Galahad. So like any good farce, there are a lot of slamming doors and slapstick comedy, but like a true romance, we're going to walk real close to the line of tragedy before we give you true love's kiss. So if you like Shakespeare, A Knight's Tale, Upstart Crow, or like maybe reruns of Frasier, I really think you're going to like this. Come see it at the B Street Comedy Festival. This is the first time this play has been read for an audience ever. And I'm just so excited that it gets to be here in a festival that's built for comedy plays. Comedy is only ever half finished on the page. It needs a crowd. It needs people. It needs laughter to be complete. And I really, I just can't wait to sit in a theater and watch it with you. So come join me. Pseudo Princess Thief is running Thursday, August 17th at 8 p.m. and Sunday, August 20th at 2 p.m. in the B Street Main Stage Theater in Sacramento. My name is Anna Watts. I am a Los Angeles-based playwright who was born and raised in Minneapolis, Minnesota. Uh, the play that I wrote that's part of the New Comedies Festival is Below Zero. Below Zero is about uh, this woman who's a stand-up comedian in New York, Nellie, uh, and she finds out that her ex-boyfriend from high school has gone missing. And so she spontaneously flies back to Minnesota um, and the only person that she can seem to convince to go look for him is her ex's current girlfriend, Marianne. So Marianne and Nellie set out on dog sleds in northern Minnesota in the middle of winter to go look for this missing man. And 
they couldn't be more different so they have to try and overcome their differences in order to find him and also in order to survive because it is very cold in northern Minnesota especially in the middle of winter and there are a lot of elements that are against them. Uh, so that's a little tidbit about Below Zero. I am really looking forward to the new Comedies Festival. I'm really looking forward to and I'm really excited about meeting the other playwrights, about meeting my team and the collaborators that I get to work with. I'm excited to see Sacramento for the first time. I've never been. So those are just some of the things that I'm really looking forward to.